All right, you guys are back. I've got the uh, the stuff that I need now, so I should be able to... I think you can make it just a workbench, right? Should be able to make... Yep, there it is right there, the uh, mechanical worm. Boom. Let's go get our buffs and stuff. Let's go get the potions. Let's go get all that good stuff again, right? Sheesh. <laughs> Gotta make sure we'll heck and die. I guess we'll get the thorns, too, you know, in case... Yeah, you know what? Sure, why not? I think those little, like, orbs... I think those little orbs that, like, rotate around... I think those shoot the lasers that heck and killed me, so I do need to watch out for that. Make sure I don't happen again, right? I suppose we'll get, uh, like, the archery potion. We didn't even use that, so we need to remember to use a Daedalus Stormbow next time and see how well that does. But, hey, it might just be a waste of time considering uh, another Iron Skin potion right there. Might just be a waste of time considering we have, uh, the heckin' this thing right here, the Fetid Bagnax thing that does an insane amount of heckin' damage already, so... I guess we'll go up here, let's go get a slice of cake, boom. Get the, uh, Bewitching Table. There you go. Get that. Hey, there's a worm right there. Get the sharpening right there. And let's go over here, and I guess, I guess we can place down the, uh... Spider Queen. I guess we'll place her on the bottom, and then I don't know. It, I think the I think that might be too high up actually. Oh whoa whoa oh as a demon eye. Why why does it look so? Oh it's because it's, it's wearing a costume. But I, guess, I I think our boss ring is a little bit too high up there. Like if I was up there, like I, I, I guess maybe I could still shoot it with the the bow thing and maybe it'd work. I don't know. But I guess we'll summon it in now, you guys. Let's do it. Oh whoa whoa angry Nimbus right there. <laughs> Let's kill that random cloud right there that's angry at us. Nice. All right, let's do it. Mechanical worm, the second one. Let's do it this time. Uh, oh wait, hold on. Let's get our uh, let's get the buffs. There you go. Iron skin, archery, thorns, and let's get a uh, eat a fish too. Sure, why not? There you go. Still a lot of stuff over here though. Let me kill him. Are we doing good? Yeah, I think we're doing well. Okay, that's good. So I have so many buffs right now. Oh my gosh. Let's do it. Mechanical worm. Boom. There you go. He's summoned in now. Oh, there he is. There he is. There he is. Hold on. And there's there's his minion. His minion's dead. That's good. Doing an insane amount of damage to him right now. Oh my gosh. Draining him hardcore. Look at this. Oh my god. I'm taking a health. I'm taking a health. I just took a health right there. He's got a lot of these, these, these laser minions I do need to watch out for, though. Hold on. Hold on. I'm going up here. I'm going up here. Okay, I'm going to the, uh, do this. There you go. Doing this second thing to... Oh, you know what? You know what? Oh my god. I'm doing so much damage right now, but he's got so many Ekin minions. I'm just following his worm. Oh, 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 40 seconds until I could heal up again, but there are a lot of lasers. So many lasers. I need to kill these things, but I'm already so low on health. Oh my gosh. Oh man, I knew that was gonna happen. I, I was running away from his heckin' laser things. Pink laser, yeah. See, I need to kill those, but like, there, there's so many of them. Man. I think we're one, f one thing away from uh, being able to... Ah, oh, that sucks, though. I had so many things going for me, he was already down so much on health, but I need to take on those laser things. I don't know how to take those guys on. I, I'm like, I know I can melee him down with a fetid bad nights thing anyways. Oh yeah, I forgot we had the egg. Man, well that sucks. We're f like one or two soul of nights away from being able to spawn in another one. You know what, I guess we'll f spawn in another one and try it again, you guys. But I, uh, I see, I, I don't think that location is really the best. Maybe I will summon him in the boss arena, which I still need to expand out. Because I don't want to be, like, trapped under there, kind of like I was right there, you know? Maybe it is a better idea to do it in the boss arena. Let's try that. Yeah, alright, well, let me go, I can get another, what, like, two Soul of Knights or whatever? Because we got, we got tons of vertebrae. Get six of those, we got tons of iron. And we have enough of those shark fins, which is great. All we need to do now is get to kill the destroyer, and we can make that mega shark, which is awesome. So, get the, uh, I think it's five of those, nice. Get the Soul of Knight, grab those, boom, there you go. And, uh, all I need to do is just get two more, which is apparently a 20% drop from Critters in the Underground Crimson, so... Definitely want to keep that in mind, so I think we have to go this way. And I guess I'll have to go kill up attacking Underground Crimson Critters again. We may be able to do it the same night if I can get the, uh, one or two Soul of Knights fast enough, you guys. So, let me try and get some real quick, and I'll see you guys here in just a bit. Alright guys, I'm back. A Blood Moon started. I do have enough Soul of Knights, though, which is good. I just crafted the, the Worm. But unfortunately, a blood moon has started. I do have my fishing rod out. I'm fishing. I have I have the butterflies in my inventory, which is great. And uh, my, my my two spiders are doing a good job of defending me from a bunch of critters. There you go. Let's see if we can get that dread nautilus guy to spawn in. That'd be really good. Man, look at the spiders even going up there and killing a cloud guy. Man, that's crazy. Boom, another one right there. Yeah, I can't even see it all. So uh, if that if that dread nautilus guy spawns in, is that his name or is that the name of the bow? I don't know. They might have similar names. <laughs> But, man, look at all the heckin' money around us, look at all the loot around us, it's crazy! Oh, I got a pass right there, nice. It's hard to tell, like, if, if my fishing rod is, uh, being bitten on right now or what, because there's so much going on on the screen, it's crazy. Oh, we got another pass right there, okay, nothing too crazy. And thankfully, my spiders, I just re-upped on their, uh, bewitching table. 
So they have 10. Oh man, we gotta. Oh nice, my spider took care of that eye. That's good. So let me let me continue fishing here. Hopefully, uh, we don't. Oh oh, oh 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 oh! We got another thing right there. We got another critter. We got another like. Ah, uh, what do you call it? I don't know. Man, my my wings aren't lasting long enough. Hold on. Did I kill that thing from here? Oh, I don't know. Oh, I did some good damage to it right there. Hold on, hold on. Man, oh, whoa! I don't know what that was that it just did right there. Hemo Hemo Goblin, I think is what it's called, which is a funny name. <laughs> I don't know if I'm able to- Oh my god! I feel like I'm like being slowed down or something like that. I can't- I, Oh man, I need to go heal up from uh, whatever her name was. But I need my spider to take care of that, that, that critter. I need to go heal up from Emily. Oh my god, I died! Come on! Man, that thing is so fast! Hemo Goblin Shark! Am I still here? Is that thing- is that thing still going to be here? Or is it despawn or something? I don't know. But here we are. I, I, I'm back, I'm back, I'm back. Ah, I might as well get the bewitching table, the sharpening, all that stuff. Alright, let's get our, uh, spider guys. Boom. That should be good. Is it still here? Or is it gone? No way up! It's still there! Okay, that's good, that's good, that's good. Trying to use as much damage I'm about to die, I died again! Man, I was trying to just soak up right there. I'm like, I spawned in a half health. I should have taken a health potion there, but whatever. It's almost dead, which is good. We have two golden, like, uh, graves, or I guess you can call that. That's pretty funny. <laughs> let's get the bewitching table. Let's get the sharpening again. Boom. Boom. Nice. All right, let's go. Let's go kill it. As well as all the- and we've- by the way, we've lost a lot of heckin', uh, companions. There we go. It's dead. It's dead. Nice. And I'm almost dead, too. <laughs> there we go. We lost a lot of, uh, NPCs. We lost, like, the guide. We lost, uh... Whatever his name was, the, the 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 goblin tinkerer guy, he's dead. Hey, look at that! I'm I'm starting to have ghosts spawn in because of my dead bodies. <laughs> that was pretty funny. But yeah, that, that was pretty good. So I, I I might I might continue fishing here, just because I I, I want to have or I want to use up that last piece of bait. So let's do that. Boom. So we have two out of the four. Okay, we got a bass. We still have bait right now. Two out of the four uh, things that spawned in during this blood moon, which is good. Now we just need that Dread Nautilus guide, and then we'll have a really good, uh, summon thing, I guess. So, let's see if we can get that or not. And, <laughs> I don't know, maybe the other one. I, I don't know what the other one was. We got, like, a giant worm thing. We got that Hemogoblin shark, which is pretty funny. Oh, another one! What?! Oh my god! I don't know how to take this- Oh, oh, oh it's like spitting blood everywhere, and it's, of course, swimming around in the heckin' ocean and stuff, too. How am I supposed to take this thing? It, it, how much else does it have? 5,000! That's a pretty sizable amount of health, holy heck! I'm trying to get some healings going on. There you go. Oh my god. I, I bet this thing despawns when it turns to daytime, though, so we have about a minute to take this thing on. As I got killed right there. And and there's a clown, too. Man, there's no way I would have survived that. Golly. All right. <laughs> let's heal. Let's, let's, let's spawn back in. Come on. There you go. Heal up instantly. Let's get our uh, bewitching table. There you go. Spawn in our blah, blah, blah. There you go. Nice. So we're basically uh, about as high health as we can be right now. 1,050th zombie. There you go. Clown down. Oh, man. That, like, blood shot that he does is crazy powerful. Did I kill him? No, there he is right there. Man. Like, every time he does that, like, I die. It's crazy how good that is. I need to see how much, like, health I have whenever he does that. It's crazy. He's able to kill us, like, instantly. Either that or I'm, like, low health every time he does that, which I'm, like, isn't really surprised. There he is. There he is. There he is. Okay, he hasn't- uh, Oh, whoa, well, he keeps going in the water. There we go, he's dead. More chum bucket, a lot of gold, nice. There's a death right there, death marker, grave marker. Man, we're getting a lot of stuff here. It's about to turn to daytime, though, which is good. In, like, two seconds. And, uh, hopefully our NPC- Hey, there we go, nice. Alright, man, those- those goblins guys are pretty tough. Pretty, pretty fast and, and- and very agile, of course, and their bloodshot does a ton of damage, I'm sure. There we go, man. Now we gotta take on the heckin' giant worm again. <laughs> the destroyer. How are we gonna do that, though? I mean, like, I guess if anything, I could have done the Daedalus Storm Bow for that thing, but I'm like, it moves so fast, I doubt that the bow would be able to even hit it. But yeah, we lost the merchant, we lost the guide, we lost the goblin tinkerer. I think that's it, honestly. So not really too crazy amount of stuff that we lost. Oh, and by the way, I've been picking up a bunch of these Nimbus Rod from those, like, cloud guys. We got an agile one there, we got a keen, we got a quick. 40 magic damage, 10 mana. Seems like a pretty good amount of, uh, like, a mana to, like, magic damage ratio there, honestly. Might want to consider, uh, using them, so. Uh, maybe I'll, maybe I'll just put them up in, like, the weapons chest for right now, which is nice and decently empty nowadays, which is awesome. Still has, uh, still have that one butterfly, which is good. A lot of top hats I'll, I'll definitely just sell, like, right now. So let's do that and get some money out of them. Ah, uh, 20 silver each. Eh, not bad. Oh, we probably have enough money now, honestly. To get that one thing from that one woman. I forgot what it, uh, what it was called. A lot of pumpkins don't want to sell those. Zombie arm, yeah, get rid of that. <laughs> don't need that trash anymore. There we go. 
Wedding Veil, Blood Zombie Banner, yeah, I don't need that garbage. Nice. Alright, well, let's go, let's see if we can quick stack. There you go, quick stack a bunch of stuff. Put the butterfly up, there you go. Anything else I don't need? Oh yeah, I have a lot of goodie bags. I guess I can open them. There you go. Bunch of goodie- yeah, those are all like cosmetics. Vampire mask, vampire shirt, vampire pants. 93 rotten eggs, what? <laughs> Ghost mask, ghost shirt, unicorn mask, unicorn shirt, unicorn pants. Treasure hunter shirt, vampire, uh... Seems like pretty much the same stuff up here as well. Man, that's a lot of cosmetic stuff. Yeah, and of course we got the pumpkin outfit. Which we didn't even get any uh, repeats right there, which is kind of funny. Hmm. Anyways, uh, I guess if anything, speaking of repeats, I'll sell some of the repeat uh, things like the wedding veil and wedding dress, etc. And I guess I'll keep the vampire pants and mask and unicorn and stuff and the ghost stuff. Oh, I can't do that. Oh, I've got a lot of Tim hats. Yeah, I've got a lot of wizard hats here. Whoops. Hey, Isaac the Merchant arrived. Nice. Sort all those items. Nice. All right, well, I guess I'll sell all those extra cosmetics I have, because golly, I don't need them. Then after this, I think we have enough money to, uh... I think I can sell all that, and that's fine. I think we'll have enough money to, uh... Buy that one thing from the Steampunker if we go to the desert and talk to her, so... There you go, sell all that garbage. Nice, go to check the piggy bank. What do we have? Uh, sort items. We have... One platinum, 86, yeah, we've got enough. I think it's one uh, platinum, 80 or 70 gold or something like that, right? So I think we're doing pretty well in that regard. So that's nice. Let's put up the fishing rod over here because we don't need that anymore. The flesh catcher. Rotten egg, I don't... I guess I'll put that in the weapons. That's kind of funny. There you go. All right, well, I, I guess I'll just pause right now. Wait until it turns to nighttime because I do have the mechanical worm, like I said. So I've got all that. Uh, I'm like, it just turned to daytime. I guess if anything, maybe I'll spend some time trying to get some like adamantite armor or adamantite in general so I could continue to upgrade my armor because of course getting more of that means getting even better armor. And I don't know if there's any adamantite over here. Oh yeah, I think there is. Yeah, a little bit of adamantite right there. Just zooming in on it. Of course, any little bit helps. I don't know how much we have right now. I guess, I guess I'll go check. And I forgot where we were last time. And I was like, oh man, there's a lot. Oh, I think it was like over here, wasn't it? Yeah. This, like, fresh cave area over here. Yeah! I don't know how to get to there from- because we never connected these two up, did we? Nogs the Goblin Tinker! <laughs> That's a fun name. Uh, I don't know if there's, uh, any adamantite over here just randomly, though, but I may just check this big map and check, because we did use the firecracker pretty well to go beyond the cave walls and, and, and see any, uh, oh, is that adamantite? No, it's dripping lava. Yeah, see, the dripping lava and the adamantite look very similar when looking on this map. And, of course, like, the background there. That looks like uh, adamantite as well, but it's not. It's like magma background or something crazy, but... Yeah, I'm not having any luck just finding, just skimming over it right now, so that kind of sucks, but... I'll, I'll continue, you know, like, maybe, like, over here. Like, maybe even, like, go all over here, because I, I... I never even went to the whole eastern side of the underworld over here, so I do need to continue adventuring this way, and maybe I'll find a bunch of adamantite there, because, golly, we found a good about this way, we might as well find a lot over here, and, of course, there's that little bit, like, uh... What was it? Oh, was this? Oh, that's amethyst, yeah. Might be some adamant out up here. Oh, yeah, I don't know if I ever told you guys, but I found another uh, bee nest over here. Like, I was just... I, I don't know if this was on camera, off camera, or what was it? I don't even know if I ever mentioned it, like I said, but... I found another bee nest over here. There's a larva right there. We could take another uh, queen bee boss battle on if we wanted to, for fun, but... Right now, I need to head to somewhere. Oh, wow, a lot of adamant out right there. Nice. Need to go there. I need to go... Like, up here. Yeah, like, right there. A small little strip of adamant height. And, uh, oh yeah, even, like, over here, wasn't there? I don't know if there was any adamantite over here. Right? This might not be deep enough, but there's, like, the... There's, like, the golem, I think you guys said, is the name of this boss. So that's going to be pretty fun here in the future, once we're actually prepared for that. And we have, like, the key or whatever to go through his locked door. But right now, we're not prepared at all. But, uh, yeah, there was a... Where was that adamantite I just saw? Like, a big vein of it or something. Need to make sure I know where that is so I can head there. Wish I could make a waypoint. Oh, yeah, here we go, here we go. Yeah, right there. And it's relatively close to the ground. I'm surprised I never saw that before. And it, I did also get comments of you guys saying, hey, if you want more adamantite, you just need to get, uh... Oh, yeah, I might as well collect, like, all the money that's been, like, dropped over here throughout the entire, the, uh, the Blood Moon. But, yeah, hey, just go break, uh, or hammer more of those crimson altars or whatever. And, of course, that'll give you more... Like, of those, uh, hard mode. Oh, Garrett the Guide. Hey, that's a pretty good little alliteration right there. Uh, that'll, that'll give you more, uh, hard mode. What do you call it? Ores, I guess it would call them, so. Yeah, I could, I could do that, but it also, like, spreads the crimson faster. But at the same time, the crimson's pretty much spread all over the place by now, right? So, or, uh, is it the crimson? Yeah, the crimson, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what we have here, of course, right? <laughs> so, yeah, I, I guess we could, uh... Was that another one of those things you guys said? 
I think it is. Gel yeah, gelatin crystal. Yeah, I think I got a comment, and there's another one right there. Saying, yeah, you, you pass through, like, gelatin crystals, like, right there. I'm glad I remembered it, like, at that last second, but... Yeah, I'm going to head, uh... I'm going to head west over here to where we just saw a bunch of adamantite. But I'm also going to head east on the underworld and... and oh, I didn't even see how much I had and how much I need, etc, etc. Man, that sucks. And right here is our first bit of adamantite, so let's grab this stuff. And is that sapphire? I think it is. Or, uh, yeah, sapphire, nice. I guess I'll grab that. Get the, uh, smart cursor. Boom. Just eating through all this trash. And it is a 5 to 1 ratio for adamantite, unfortunately, so... We're gonna have to get 5 adamantite ore to get 1 ingot. And you need, like, 20-something ingots to get, like, a chest piece slash leggings. I think it's even more expensive. I think you actually need, like, 30 or something like that for the chest piece and leggings. And well, we already have the helmet, I think, right? Yeah, we already have the helmet. But yeah, we're gonna need a lot of that adamantite ore, you guys, it's crazy. How much should we get right there, by the way? 26, so we can get like five more ingots right there, so that's good. Depending on how much we already have at home, we may be able to get a, a sixth ingot out of that. But, uh, I'm looking right now, see if I could find any more in this general area that we're in right now. And I'm like, this hasn't really been too explored, honestly, so maybe I'll just explore around here. There may be some adamantite, like, here, and I don't even know about it, because I've never even been here before, apparently. But yeah, I'm, I'm gonna do all this off-camera, like I said, right there, so... I'll see you guys here in just a bit, and hopefully we can get ourselves some better adamantite armor, and, uh, get fully suited up in that stuff, so... I'll see you guys here in just a bit. Man, how many times did I say that in the past, like, three minutes? Sheesh. Alright guys, I'm back. I just got a notification saying you feel vibrations from below or something like that. Hold on. I have enough adamantite right now, actually, to make both an- or, uh, just the chest piece, I believe. Where is that? There it is right there. Yeah, the breastplate. Let's get that. Boom. Let's get that. Let's get the, uh, helmet on now. I had the night vision on just because, uh, I was doing, you know, mining, so. Either way. Ah, oh, man, I need to go. I hope it doesn't spawn in, like, right now, though, but, uh, we need to get the iron skin. There you go, boom. At least get that one. That, 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 that's good, that's good. There we go, get that, get that. And let's go! Let's go, we are- uh, oh, oh, I think I took like a Spelunker potion or something, but that accidentally, whoops. Either way, let's go over here to the boss arena, this should be good, let's spawn in both of our minions. Boom, boom. And get the spider queen in here too. Alright, did we take the iron skin or not? Uh, did we take it or not? Oh yeah, we did, okay, that's good. Alright, that's great. Rest, uh, restoration or whatever. Now, is it gonna spawn in or not? Cause it's, it can't, it, it happened like, oh man, I don't know. How long does it take for the, oh, oh, yep, there you go, the destroyer has been awoken. There he is, there he is, there he is. Try and do as much damage to him as possible, and then kill all of his eyeball minion guys too. Oh, there he is again, hold on, hold on. I'm trying to kill ah, as many of his eyeball minions as possible, because they do the, uh, the, the laser damage that we need to watch out for. Oh, 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 there's a lot of them back there. Where are they? Man, I don't know where they're at. I don't know where they're at. There they are, there they are, there they are. Let's kill them. There you go, we got them right there, nice. Let's get them again. We have a great vantage point right here. Hold on, hold on. There's a lot of them. There's a couple of them right there, come on. Oh man, there we go, we got them, nice. Those minions are all down. Doing some great damage directly to the... Oh no, 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 no. We're, we're taking a lot of damage right now though. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Oh man, oh, 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 oh. Come on, come on, he's almost down. No, I died again. I died again from the probes. Man. Oh, he was so wick and low on health. Oh, man. What, what, what? Oh, yeah, we do. We have the adamantite. We have a little bit extra damage, I think. I think our current armor. Yeah, we're doing a uh, 5%. This does 6% extra damage. 4 extra defense, too. Man, we're so close right there. But I'm like, I wasn't even really preparing for it. I, or at least, you know, I didn't, like, summon it in or anything like that on my own. I got another trifold map. Got a bunch of stuff here, actually. But what, what, what other potions could I possibly use? during that, though, because we got the iron skin right there, which is good. I guess if anything, maybe the thorns, I could take that. Yeah, I guess I'll take that. And I'll put up the, uh, the extra armor over here, because, golly, my inventory is full of heckin' stuff. I was mining, and, uh, I have even more adamantite ore right here I could use, so... You know what, uh, there you go, adamantite bars. I think I'm pretty... I, I think I'm really close, actually, you guys, to making the, uh... The adamantite leggings, or boots, or whatever, and getting, like, the whole set. And getting a set bonus, but... I kind of want to do the battle, like, right now. Do I want to wait? How many, how many, how many do I need? The guide's name is, uh, Marty, by the way, because I, <laughs> I spawned it, I, I killed a, a voodoo demon or voodoo red devil, I think they're called now, uh, in hard mode. Killed one of those things. Forbidden robes, what? Uh, don't, I, yeah, it actually doesn't seem that good. <laughs> but, uh, adamantite leggings. Yeah, I just need five more, so I need to get, like, 23 more adamantite ore, and we're goody guys. I don't know if, uh, down here, which, by the way, I started, uh, going this way. Like, there's- look at all this. I still haven't even made that much progress, but... 
But I don't know if there's any adamantite here that I can mine. Because all this was done uh, during that like teleportation potion thing. All this I just did off camera. And I'm not seeing any adamantite right now. Mm, there may be some over here. And what's funny is that like, uh, where was it? It was like basically like right here. Oh yeah, and that's that's where the uh that's where I killed the wall of flesh again off camera. <laughs> it was really easy with the hacking uh, the whatever the claws are called now. But oh yeah, I need to go here. There's a lot of area here that probably has some uh, adamantite. I just need to go whip with the firecracker and see if uh, there's any adamantite hiding over there. Especially because look at all this. And I don't know if I like I said earlier. I don't know if I want to break or like hammer or whatever you want to call it another crimson uh, altar to get more of that stuff to spawn in. Maybe I will. If I'm really desperate for it, but I'm like, we only need like 23 more of that. So, you know, I'm like, we could probably find that by just going to the edge of the map there underground. Right. And I I, I know I have a lot of heckin stuff in this, too. Oh, yeah. I killed like two rune guys, which is pretty interesting. Oh, and there's a keen heck fire, too. I found, I don't know what dropped that. I just saw it on the ground. And I was like, hey, that, that's pretty that, 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 like it does pretty good damage. So might as well keep it. So I picked it up and it went inside the void vault. And here it is right here. 63 melee damage. 60. Well, that one's 66. Is it 63? Because it's not in my inventory. OK, well, it's, in, it's a little bit less than the Amarok thing there. So I guess I'll keep that. It's not even like modified or anything like that, which is crazy. I also got like rune robes and rune hat there for like some weird rune guy. And there's a thorns thing. Yeah, I guess I'll oh, potion of return. Yeah, hunter potion. Yeah, I'm not crazy about that. And there's some mithril and stuff there. So eh, I guess I can see what I get out of that, but. You know, I might as well uh, loot all that and then quick stack all the stuff. Boom, there you go. And uh, I'll keep the adamantite in my inventory and I guess I'll right click that. Robot shirt, robot mask, robot pants, that's fun. Uh, I don't know where to put that honestly, because golly, my inventory. Like in my inventory, all my chests, everything is like full, it's crazy. But uh, I might as well get rid of like the mud, the dirt, don't need that trash. And I'll keep the ultra bright helmet on, just because I'm going to go mining again. Off camera, of course, so not too crazy, but let's see what we're going to get out of the extractinator. Uh, anything good there? Just sapphire, gold, copper ore, tungsten, and silver there. Not too bad. Nothing too crazy, though, but, uh, how much money do we have now, by the way? We have, oh, we have two platinum. Oh, my gosh. That's good stuff. Man. <laughs> All right, well, uh, yeah, let me, let me just pause. Like, you guys already know the deal. Let me just pause. Go get 23 or so more adamantite ore. Get a full set of, uh, adamantite armor, and then let's go do the destroyer again with a mechanical worm right there. So, uh, let me go do all that. Oh, and by the way, the, uh, the Wall of Flesh dropped the Hard Warrior Emblem, so it's a plus one defense. I don't know how, like, the plus four percent extra critical strike. That's good. I don't know if I want to switch them, though, because that's lucky. This one's hard. I'll keep it for right now, though, but I don't know if, uh, I don't know which one I'd rather have, to be quite honest, but for right now, like I said, let me just pause and, uh, get, like, 23 or so more, uh, ore. And I'll see you guys here in just a bit. We're going to take on the destroyer for like the 10th time or something like that. Jeez. <laughs> hopefully we can uh, hold on. And hopefully, uh, I don't know what, I guess I can look up what the, uh, the set bonus is going to be for that. Adamantite armor. Extra movement speed, I think. Yeah, I think it's just extra movement speed. So that, I'm like, that's kind of interesting and all, but you know, at least we'll have better uh, like defense altogether. Like four extra defense from that. Uh, I don't know, probably like four more from this one if I uh, get the adamantite greaves or pants or whatever they're called so that'll be pretty good but like I said let me just uh, try and get that adamantite and I'll see you guys here in just a bit all right guys I'm back I think we have enough I've got 29 adamantite ore in my inventory let's uh, not, not open that up so I can do this easily sheesh there you go five right there and I have uh, just one more adamantite ore and I can make ourselves a uh, another and get right there just randomly so either way let's do this boom 18 and, uh, oh, whoa, whoa, hold on. Whoa, wait, what was that? Durandal? What is all the, oh, ah, man, see, there's like a, there it is right there. Durandal, hallowed joust, is this, uh, is this stuff that's hallowed ore? Or hallowed, but yeah, hallowed bar. Ooh, 62 summon damage. Your summons will focus on, but that's kind of like this thing, though. It says it's summon damage, but it doesn't, it doesn't actually summon in a creature. So, wait, strike enemies to gain, oh, I gain the attack speed, I think. Oh, 99 melee damage. Insane knockback. Build momentum to increase attack power. Fast speed, 99 damage. I assume the uh, attack speed isn't really the best right there unless you, you know, you build momentum first. Probably needs to be riding on something like a, like a unicorn for that. That'd be pretty fun. Gun gear or gun, gun gunner. Gun gun gunner. What is that thing? Oh, it's like the thing that uh, was like that, that one thing we got from the demon. Excalibur, 84 melee damage. Ooh, ooh. Are they again like <laughs> the legendary fetid Fagnac thing. Like, is anything ever going to be better than that? Hallowed Repeater, 59. Ooh. So it goes up by 10. 
If I get that. That's how many hallowed bars? Oh, I've got 16 hallowed bars. Yeah. Hallowed hood. Ooh, we can make some hallowed armor. Oh, never mind. Now it's an adam and speaking of adamantite, I might as well make the uh where is that? Uh, the leggings, yes. Yeah, that's what I want. Let's do it. 12 defense. So we have uh nine defense right there. We're going up to 12 defense. 4% increased critical strike chance and 5% increased movement speed, but no extra melee damage or whatever, but whatever. There you go. So now we're going to have a full set of Adamantite now. Boom. Nice. And now I've got the- I've still got the pumpkin skin on right now, but... Let's see. Set bonus, 18%- Oh, wait, whoa! 18% increased melee and movement speed? So melee speed goes up even more? Man! Is this even faster now? If I get the DPS meter out, is it going to be like a 1300 uh, DPS? Or something like that? Let's see, let's go get the accessories. Where is that at? There it is right there, DPS meter. Let's go check. If we get the full- I'm like- I know I look like a heckin' pumpkin. <laughs> Which is pretty funny. Uh, yeah. It was like 1100, now it's like 1200. Now remember, this only goes up by like 20% or something like that, or it only gains like 20% of the, uh, the upgrades or whatever, because this is already heckin' crafted as tree. Well, it's kind of normalized now. Down under 1200, so... I guess maybe it-, it you know, I keep getting criticals here, so sometimes it goes up, sometimes it goes down, because you can see sometimes I get, I'm doing 200 damage. Sometimes it's only 100, only 100. But yeah, averaging out about uh, 1160, 1170, 80. I say we're doing pretty well, you guys. Not bad. Hmm. And we got the DPS meter. Uh, should I keep that on? I don't, I don't know. I'm, I'm, I st I, we still need to do that one thing. To, oh yeah, I think we have to go fishing. You like do those fishing things with Simon? Yeah, I think that's what we have to do to do that, unfortunately, but... So I put our armor up, so now there's our full mithril armor, just kind of put up there nice. And uh, now we have the full adamantite. Let's let's get prepared to do the destroyer. I don't know, what time is it? Oh yeah, we can do it here in a couple hours. You know, a couple in-game hours, that is. So, uh, how are we doing inventory-wise? We got that, we got the mechanical worm there. I guess now we'll just get uh, some potions, like the iron skin. And we have a greater healing potion there. Do we have uh, any more of those? Yeah, we do. Yeah, there you go, nice. Let's get a full stack of that, just because why not? And let's get the iron skin, wherever that is. Yeah, we got swiftness there too. Yeah, there's thorns. Definitely want to get that. And uh, I don't know if I want to get the. Uh, well, does does invisibility even work? Like, uh, I, yeah, it, okay, it just says it lowers the spawn rate of enemies. So I guess that's what it does actually, instead of uh, you know, being in like not noticed by enemies. I guess. Uh, let's see, where is it? I know it's one of these thin-looking ones. Do we not? Have, oh, is that it? Yeah, there it is right there. Okay, yeah, it's the yellow one. Okay, that's good. Uh, and I have some random pumpkins. I have my inventory, so I need to go put those up as well. Is there anything else that I want to get, though? We have the thorns, we have the iron skin. Oh, I guess if anything, maybe the gravitation potion would be pretty interesting for this, because, you know, it's, it's going to be, like, stuck on the ground or whatever. Perhaps? Increases. Is there one that's going to increase your, uh, regeneration? I'm like, this is a restoration one. I don't know if there is one that increases, uh, regeneration. Well, if there is one that does it, I'm not seeing it, because I'm hovering over, like, everything right now, and I'm not seeing anything, so that sucks. But yeah, I, I guess we'll just take those two potions there, and I guess, uh, see if we have any food. Here, that's decent. Uh, minor improvements. Oh yeah, the fried egg. Guess we'll get that one. I still don't know what that actually does. I need to, uh, you know what, I'm gonna, I'm gonna look that up right now. Let's do it. Okay, so well-fed, plenty satisfied, and exquisitely stuffed. Well-fed, I guess, is, uh, low or minor improvements, plenty satisfied. I, t satisfied, I guess, is, uh, medium improvements or whatever it is. And exquisitely stuffed is the major. And, uh, well, with the fry egg, I think that's, uh, medium. So that would be plus three defense, pl uh, plus three percent critical... Critical hit chance for all attacks. Plus 7.5% melee speed, nice. Plus 7.5 damage, including summons. Plus uh, 0.75 minion knockback. Plus 30% movement speed and plus 10% mining speed. Ooh, interesting. And the buff icon has a, has a set of crab. I guess that's what it is for medium, huh? Hmm. And it lasts 14 minutes. Interesting. Let's get uh, let's get the speed or whatever that is right there. Yeah, 20% increased uh, movement and mining speed. Interesting. Give ourselves a double enchant or a uh, double summons or yeah, the yeah, summons for the spiders. There you go. And the queen spider staff. Is there anything else that we want to get? Uh, what are the pumpkins over here? There we go. 558 pumpkins. <laughs> Jeez, that's crazy. Just looking right now. I don't know. I think we're pretty well set, you guys. I've got this. Like our accessories. Do we want to get any other accessories? I think we have pretty good accessories. I don't think we need to get anything new. I think we're pretty well set in that regard as well. Hmm. I guess if, uh, if I want to kill those eyes from a distance, definitely want to go over to the Adamantite Repeater. The staunch Adamantite Repeater and try and get them from a distance, because, you know, they shoot lasers, so they have, like, infinite heckin' range or whatever, so we need to watch out for that. So, uh, pre... Zoom... Oh, I was already zoomed out a little bit. Nice. Zoom out a little bit here, and uh, let's get the Spider Queen going. Boom, there she is. Let's get our buffs going. There's the thorns. I don't know... 
how many attempts this is now, but whatever. We're, we're jumping into it now, you guys. Do we have everything now? Do we have the sharpness? Yep, we got the sharpening. We have the iron skin. We have everything. Yeah, and yep, yep. There's the plenty satisfied with the crab icon. So, yep. So, that's those buffs we read just a moment ago are what we have right now. So, that's good. Let's do it. Let's get the fetid backpacks out. Let's spawn in the mechanical worm. Boom. All right. There he is. All the way down there. Whoa, 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 whoa. Have to wait for him to spawn up here or jump up here. Nice. Now we're doing damage directly to him. That's good. Man. Look at this. Taking him down a ton, but there, there are his, uh, his, his laser minions we need to watch out for. Oh, there they are again. Hold on, let's get a heal. There we go, nice. Where are the other ones at? There's another one right there. Let's keep on doing some damage to him, because he's draining hardcore right now. There, there is, there we go, laser minion again. Uh, there we go, got him again, nice. My spider's doing a great job. Ah, man. Oh, oh, nice, 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 there he is. Let's go up, 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 up. Kill the laser minions, got it. Man, we're taking a lot of damage. We're taking a lot of damage, but he is too. Let's go down here and... Try and do some damage to him. Try and kill him. Oh, and he's down. Finally. Finally. He still has his minions here, though. We need to watch out. We need to watch out. There's still, like, at least one more laser guy. There he is. There he is. There he is. There you go. We got him. Nice. All right. We finally killed the destroyer there. Golly. Feels good. And we had a pretty good amount of health, too. I think we're over half health, it looked like. Oh, by the way, I forgot to mention. So you guys know the life crystals. Hey, I actually called it the right thing right there, uh, that time. Nice. Oh, let's go by the yeah, yeah, we're in the area. Let's go by the thing from that uh, the steampunker. Oh, I died. Oh, yeah, I died there because of the uh, because uh, that was from the other. Uh, oh, there's a ghost right there because because there's a grave. But uh, what was I saying? Oh, yeah, you guys know the life crystals increase your life by like 20 or something like that. And in hard mode, you can't increase it past like 400 because we already have the 400 right now. But if you want to increase your life in hard mode, you need stuff called like the life fruit. But it increases it only by five. I found one of those in the jungle. I don't know when, but I remember I had. Oh, I think I was. Yeah, that was when I was getting adamantite in the jungle. Yeah. And I found one. I don't know where I found it because I just found it in my inventory like after the fact while I was, you know, putting stuff up. But I have one. So now we can go up to 405 health. You seem to go home and uh, I don't know what chest it's in. Oh, I think actually I think I know an idea which chest it's probably in. But uh, let's go to shop. Let's go buy the. Does she have more stuff? Feels like she might have more stuff, but uh, let's let's get the clem clen clentaminator creates and destroys biomes when sprayed. Okay, let's do that. Boom! One platinum, seventy gold. We still have sixty-seven gold after that. Oh my gosh! Now let's get the green solution used by the clentaminator spreads the purity. Let's get uh, wait, how much was that again? Twenty-one silver. Eh, twenty-one silver, twenty-five copper. That's with the discount for having the high happiness and whatever. I guess we can get like about fifty in total. Just kind of test this thing out. There you go. Let's go test it out on the uh the the. Crimson next to our house, though, you guys. Now, I don't know if this is permanent. Oh, whoa, a falling star almost just happened right there. I don't know if this is per- Oh, wait, did we get anything from the destroyer right there? Oh, yeah, we did. Soul of my- Whoa, we got 30 hallowed bars. We got, like- Yeah, no, we got 25 from the, uh, from the- From the Skeletron, yeah. I was about to say, we got double, but no, we got, uh, We didn't get 15, we got 25 last time. But still, we're up to- How many? We have 55, I think, right now? Wait, no, we have 16 from it. What? We did get, like, double. No, I didn't- yeah, I didn't make anything out of it. Yeah, we got a ton! Huh! What about the- uh, I guess maybe I could pull it up in the, uh... What's this? Buckets of bolts? Defeat the three nocturnal mechanical menaces. Yeah, okay, so we have two of those done. That's good for this, uh... Achievement slash whatever you want to call it. So that's good. So now we have, uh, 46 of these here, which... I thought we had a little bit more, but whatever. I guess if anything- Oh, what is this thing? Pumpkin workbench. <laughs> uh, let's see, let's... Oh, let's get the hallowed bars back in our inventory. I want to see, uh, what else we can make. Hallowed plate mail. Hallowed hood. Oh, wait, yeah, what is that? That's that's the chest piece, isn't it? Oh, it goes down, though. 15 defense while our adamantite breastplate is 16. Mm. And 6% uh, increased. Well, this is 7% in critical strike chance. Sheesh. Two goldfish over there. Sheesh. Pumpkin platform. Pumpkin workbench. Pumpkin pie. Hey. Oh, what is that again? Medium improvement. Hey, you know what? We have actual hundreds of pumpkins. We might as well make one of those, because, you know, more medium improvements is better. Hallowed repeater. 63 range damage. I think 59 range damage was, uh... Oh, wait, hold on. Yeah, that was the Hallow Repeater we saw earlier. Why is this doing more damage now? I didn't take the Archery Potion or anything. Oh, it's probably because I have the, uh, yeah, I have that, 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 that fried egg thing going on right now. Nice. Yeah, see, I, I, oh, yeah, how much do we do now? 103. Yeah, let's go check the, uh, DPS meter. Now that we have the fried egg thing going on right now, plenty satisfied. I'm gonna go see the DPS meter. It's gonna say about our DPS now. Like, how much did it actually go up with the fetid bag next thing? Is it in here? Oh, yeah, there it is right there. It's, it's really getting full there, so I, uh, oh, I think the thing is in here, isn't it? Yeah, there it is right there, Life Fruit. Increases your, yep, permanently increases maximum life by five. So, of course, you know, it's not like 20 or 10 or whatever it was uh, with the life crystals, but hey, 
it's better than nothing, right? Now we're going to be 405 lives, so that's good. Is there anything else I want to put up? I don't think so. If anything, you know what? I'll get a good amount of those uh, pumpkins. What's that's the wrong thing? Here you go, pumpkins here, 558. Get a good amount of those pumpkin pies. I guess I ought to be in a new uh, cooked fish, because this one only does minor improvements, so... Yeah, I might as well get something that's good, right? Let's see, where is it on this one? I can make a jack-o'-lantern. Ooh, oh yeah, yeah, I forgot. Oh, yeah, you know what? I'm like, it is Halloween season. Hopefully by the time this video... Well, I guess if the video comes out in November. Because I'm recording a ton of footage. Wait, what? Why does it look like that? Oh, it's... Oh, okay, okay, because it's lit up. I guess I... Uh, can I make it not lit up, though? Oh, I guess it was like... It's like RNG, like what the carving looks like. Okay, that's kind of like a scared-looking pumpkin. The other one over here looked like an angrier, uh... Is that a sad pumpkin? I can't even tell. Huh. Alright, well, that's pretty neat. Uh, what was I doing? Oh, yeah, I was going to make pumpkin pie. Where was it on here? Do I need to be... Oh, yeah, here we go. Oh, I need, probably need to be next to the cooking pot. Yeah, there it is right there. Wait, no. Wait, what? I, I was... I get away from the cooking pot and I can make it. What? Okay, well, I'm not going to complain about it, but, uh... Uh, oh, I can only stack up the 30. Okay, whatever, not that big of a deal. That's that's pretty good. Let's favor that, though. though. There we go, nice. And, uh, yeah, I'm going to continue, because it... I don't know if it's only going to be an October thing. I'm recording this on October 14th, by the way. I think I think one of my death things said that, so you guys already figured that out by now, right? Sheesh. But I, I'm, I'm going to get as many pumpkins as possible, because this pumpkin pie seems pretty good. There may be more exclusive pumpkin-related things we can do here in the future. And by the way, let's get that life fruit going. Boom, 400... Oh! It just turns uh, one of my things into yellow. Nice. And I just got a, I just got an achievement for get a life. Oh yeah, I said it there in the middle, too. <laughs> That's pretty funny. Jeez. That's, that's casual and savage at the same time, which is cool.